Now to an NBC 15 News reality check. After an alarming weekend full of shootings, Mobile's mayor is calling the justice, the justice system broken and is asking for more help keeping criminals in jail. NBC 15's Andrea Ramey reports the mayor is also asking lawmakers to help fund more judges. There's a Senate bill now that would add a district judge for Mobile County. One senator explains why that's not going to pass this session. Mobile Mayor Sandy Stimson says changes need to happen in the court system to help reduce crime. One of those changes is an increase in state funding for more judges. Mobile, over the last couple of decades, have had, has had insufficient funding for our court system. Our Statistics show that Mobile County is a, a in-need county. A letter sent to the governor and lawmakers two months ago from Alabama's chief justice says Mobile needs two more circuit court judges and an additional district court judge. Mobile County presiding circuit court judge Michael Youngpeter says he has 800 cases on his docket. Let's take Jefferson County as an example. They have 22 circuit judges doing what the eight circuit judges down here do. And they have the same number of cases. Just throwing money uh, to the judiciary to simply increase the bureaucracy size. I don't think is the uh, is the answer. Escambia County Senator Greg Albritton, who chairs the Senate General Fund Committee, says lawmakers created the Judicial Resource Allocation Commission that identifies areas that need more judges and ones that have too many. It can also reallocate judgeships when there's a vacancy to an area in need. But Albritton says that hasn't happened. We have provided a means and a process where we can make the changes and to adjust this way. If it's not functioning, we need to revisit that in some way. The Chief Justice told Alabama Daily News that even if the commission reallocated judges in this state, there would still be a need for additional ones in Alabama. In Mobile, Andrea Ramey, NBC 15 News.